Yes guys, what's happening? I'm Lamar Aaron and right now I'm sitting here with Jesse Lingard. He's going to be giving us some insights into the training ground of United. So the first thing is, is who works the hardest in training? I'd have to say Ander Herrera. Um, you know, I think he gives 100% in what he does. You know, in everything he does pretty much, so I'd say Ander. You can see that. So who would you say does not turn up into training, but always turns on in a match day? Um, well, to be fair, I think, you know, most of the lads, you know, they train very well and then obviously take it into the game. I think if you have a, you know, a poor week's, you know, training, yeah. I don't think you can be mentally prepared for the game. Does that affect you actually, like, the training? Yeah, I think if you have a good a good week's, you know, training, um, you know, I think, you know, you're mentally prepared for the game. Also, who would you say is always early? Uh, Mkhitaryan. Yeah. Yeah, ever since he's, you know, been bought, he's, he's been in, you know, very, very early. That's decent. So who would you say is always late? Late. Pogba, always late. No matter what for, he's always late. He's dancing though, yeah. Yeah, yeah <laughs> always good vibes. That's good. So who would you say as well, like, bosses the gym? Like, there's always one player that always can lift the Um, Ashley Young's always in the gym. And I'd say probably Ebra as well, he's always in the gym. So who never, ever, ever stops running? I think Antonio Valencia. Um, I think you see in games, he never gets tired. Uh, he's always going to 90 minutes um, and even in training as well, he trains very well. Definitely. So we know you lack a nutmeg, and we know that for a fact. But who would you say in your team is the king of nutmeg? I'd probably say Pogs again. Yeah. You know, he tries it a lot in training. Um, you see he's that guy though. Yeah, he's yeah, he is, he is, he is. Most times it comes off to be fair. Who scores the most worldies? Like it could be training, it could be games, just who would you say scores Ebra. the worldies? Ebra. Is that good? Yeah. Remember the, the game on tour, his first game, and he scored over a kick. Yeah, but he, that's ridiculous, though. Like, <laughs> technique, everything. That exactly. Is madness. So would you say that's one of the best players you've, you've seen played with? As yeah, well? yeah, bro. Cool. Which outfield player also likes to go in goal? To go in goal? Yeah. I think Rooney like that. I think Rooney's... Really? Yeah, 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 yeah. I think he'd like, I think he'd like to be going there. I thought he was going to say something like Daily Blind or something like that. <laughs> like, no, but don't you like Daily Blind looks like he yeah, can like, enjoy being yeah, in yeah, goal? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'd say Rooney. Cool. So, if you could pick a five-a-side team out of your players, who would you pick? Um, at the back, I'd pick Daly. I think you need like a player at the back who's going to be composed, you know, you reassured on the ball, ball exactly. Yeah, yeah, um, midfield, I'd say Pogba. You need that bit of, a bit of flair in midfield. Um, I'll say Ander as well. He's got a bit of bite to him. Yeah, um, you need that well. energy, that aggression. We've got decent techers as well, given that. Yeah, 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 very good. Um, Marcus Rashford up front. I think he's got the, the skills at the top you yeah. know, to beat a player and then score. Especially in five side as well. Yeah, exactly. Um, in net, obviously, David Dea. You're not having yourself, no? Oh, my, I, I, all right. <laughs> I thought, and obviously I me. you going to put yourself Nah, obviously, obviously me at the end then. Sweet. So who never, ever gives the ball away? It's always that one player that you can't get the ball off. I'd probably say Pogba again. I think even from young, you know, it's hard getting the ball off him. Yeah. You know, he's well, that you big. With him yeah, yeah, yeah. So that big, that strong. You know, you can't get the ball off him. So, like, who flies into tackles in training? Because you always get that one player that literally <laughs> takes what they do in the game and do it in training. Mark Yeah, you get that. Do you know, that do you know what as well? Shot. Do you know who else? Nah, nah. I changed that, actually. Eric, my Eric. First few weeks when but they come. Calm, nah, nah, no. Nah, but first few weeks when they come, like bam, nah, two foot, everything. Nah, I'm not that. He looks everything, calm. Eric. Serious? Honestly, trust me. Yeah, yeah. So who will make a good coach? Um, I would say Michael Carrick. Yeah, you can see that. Yeah, he's got the experience. He's got the professionalism of a coach. Um, really? Yeah. I also, though, obviously, I think they're both done the badges now, so yeah. I think you know they'll be a good fit. So I'm guessing I know the answer to this one, but who do you say is the fastest? Probably say Valencia, you know. What? I thought you were going to say Rashford because that he can blow. Yeah. Like he can chip. Valencia or Rashi, I'd say. Yeah. Yeah, I'd say Rashi. Rashi. Last, who is the worst loser when it comes to, you know that you have the five sides? Yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. Yeah, that is Always, no yeah. As soon as you lose, it's moles all day. Well, how bad is it though? No, it's bad. Yeah, like, can't talk to him. No, nah, yeah, nothing. He'll blame everyone. So I take it again, he's the biggest moaner then? Yeah. That's the next question. So there's no yeah, yeah, biggest moaner you will, yeah. If he, if, he lo if he loses, yeah. But if I he mean, wins... I guess that comes with passion though. Yeah. Like and then if he wins, he'll talk about it all day. Oh. <laughs> that is one that loves him, <laughs> yeah. he loses. 
So lastly, the final question is, who is the best penalty taker in training? I'll probably say Rooney. Put some tackles on Yeah, he practices always through most days, and then obviously when it comes to the game, you know, yeah. he's prepared for that. Steps up to and it. He's put most of them away this season, so. So there you go, guys. That's teammates with Jesse Lingard. If you like the video, make sure you hit the like button. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, and don't forget to leave a comment below.